Hey everyone, welcome back to Melissa's Kitchen Table. Today I have a Trader Joe's haul for you. And we've been on vacation, so we have a little bit of a, not so much of a stock up, but um, some extra things to get. I'll start on this side this week. I got two packages of cream cheese. I'm going to be making a dip today, Saturday, when I film this. And uh, we're going to a family party tonight, so I'm going to be making the chicken cordon blue dip. I'll link below, which um, calls for two cream cheese. Then my husband picked this up, uncured pork and beef hot link sausages. I don't really like sausage, so that's all for him. I got our standard pork loin chops, uh, French bone and center cup. I got a package of ground turkey for that dip as well. Then for lunch on Monday, I got some of the tempura shrimp crunch rolls. These are super good. Really like those. And then I got a thing of the Trader Joe's New England clam chowder. Um, I don't like canned soup, but this one, um, obviously it's not canned, but this one is a very good, um, I like this one a lot. That one's good. Got our traditional package of chicken shawarma thighs. Love those. For Sunday dinner, I'm going to be making, um, and I have a video for it, which I'll link down below. It's, I don't really know the name of it. It's kind of like a goulash. It's our family favorite. It's um, some kind of pasta, usually elbow noodles. This time I have fazili with tomato soup, which I also bought from there, and ground beef. Um, I got some of the Black Forest ham for the dip and the shredded Swiss and Greer blend. That is super key to the Cordon Bleu dip. It's delicious. Then I picked something up new from Trader Joe's I've never seen before. It's chili onion crunch in olive oil with dried garlic and peppers. That looks super good. I'll show you the ingredients. So, can't wait to try that out. Um, probably going to put that on chicken, maybe the pork, not sure. Alright, so got one zucchini and three of their local yellow squash. It was cheaper to buy it this way than in the package. One avocado that was expensive, it was $1.79 and that's a regular avocado. Got a um, Spaghetti squash, I think that was $3.29. Got a head of iceberg lettuce. Huge bag of chips for the dip uh, for the party. Got a thing of asparagus. A package of broccoli florets. A package of cauliflower florets. Some of the organic spring mix. I like to mix that and the iceberg. Grab some sweet red cherries. And I was super excited to find that they had organic black figs. Grab that. That I think was $4.99. Got two things of the organic rice cauliflower. We love that. We usually serve it with the mandarin orange chicken. That's Kane saying hi. Over here we got four, five gala apples. And last but not least, I got a package of taco shells. Now let me tell you, the last time I got their taco shells, every single shell was smashed to pieces. The box was perfect looking, just like this. No nicks, no bends, no nothing on it. But every single taco shell, it was just like a pile of crushed chips. So I don't know. Hopefully this one's not like that. Normally, I've never had that happen before. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you do, please leave me a thumbs up, hit subscribe and share, and I'll talk to you all next time. Bye.